Uh, one, great, one great thing I think we can all agree about in America is that we have an entrepreneurial spirit. And whenever people see an opportunity to make a buck, they are the best in this country mm -hmm. at jumping in. Now, with all the incidents with black males and police officers right. around the country in recent uh, <laughs> weeks, uh, the folks at Zagat noticed <laughs> that this might be an opportunity. So they have put out the Black Man's Guide to Police Departments. <laughs> Because if you're a black man who's <laughs> traveling around the country, you might want to know. So, like, here's a, here's a small town one. Uh, tired of the cold, sterile beatings of big city police departments? Well, keep your hands where we can see them and say hello to the small town charm of the Stubville, Indiana PD. But an N word to the wise. When stopped, be extra polite and prepare to answer direct questions like, where are you coming from? Where are you headed? And what the fuck are you looking at? <laughs> and don't bother bringing drugs. The officers here have plenty and will plant them in your glove compartment <laughs> free of charge. <laughs> uh, Maricopa County, Arizona, you know. Uh, you're the pinata at this close to the border racial... <laughs> profiling hub where everyone knows your name because it's always Jose. <laughs> yes, the good news for black men is the precinct devotes most of its attention to Mexicans. The bad news is they consider anyone darker than Anderson Cooper a Mexican. <laughs> and the best part of being racially profiled in Arizona, it's a dry hate. Looking for brutality with personality? Well, then New York City is your incarceration destination. Taste the pavement. In the greatest city in the world, where morning, noon, or night, it's always Giuliani time. But New York is never cheap, so expect to reach for your wallet. And when you do, get shot. Stop that noise. That's the old noise with the old crowd. San Francisco. San Francisco is where the elite meet to get beat. Whether you're interested in a nickel ride down historic Lombard Street, a late night chokehold in Chinatown, or a 60s style harassing, <laughs> I hate Ashbury. You haven't been assaulted until you've been assaulted in an assault vehicle by the bay. <laughs> On the minus side, in liberal San Francisco, annoying self-righteous hippies will ineffectually jump to your defense. <laughs> On the plus side, the cops will beat the shit out of them, too. <laughs> and Pensacola, Florida. Ever find yourself longing for the down-home blatant racism of the old Confederacy? Look no further than this death trap on the Redneck Riviera, where the South may rise again, but you won't. <laughs> yes, you're always going for your gun in this antebellum hamlet, where each traffic stop comes with a complimentary wood shampoo. Because nothing says classic bigotry like a southern sheriff with mirrored sunglasses leaning into your car and saying, you a long way from home, boy. 